Hey guys, Jeff Howard here from kiteboarding.com and we've got the new harness from Ride Engine. This is their version of a seat type, uh, shorts type harness and they did a really good job. This thing is well built, well constructed and very well designed. If you're into that minimal uh, type harness need uh, and you like the seat type harness but you're worried about the straps and kind of how it all appears or whatever it may be, this has all the internal straps like a seat harness to keep that lower hook point very popular. We've sold these for many, many years. We've sold the seat type harness like this, but Ride Engine took it to the next level and have done a lot of neat little small things that make the harness. Um, for one, what I really like about it is their double strap design in here. Their straps are really nice, high quality. They got the little pull tongues on here stitched in so you can hang on and adjust this, but it's doubled up like this and allows you um, to put on basically any harness that will take up to a two strap and nowadays that's pretty much any one of them um, You can use any spreader bar. It's got these tongues. So they designed this harness This is one of the first ones in the seat that is designed with a pocket for those tongues to slip in there like that So then you can put the double straps on and you're ready to go with basically any one of them So getting one of these board shorts that have that ability and what that does it locks that bar into place the other thing that they've done is a neat little adjustment right here in the front. I know it's these little small things, but I tell you, once you spend a lot of time in these things and they're either real loose on you and you have really no adjustability, they have this really neat little clean buckle that you can adjust over to four different adjustments. So you have that medium range and you can definitely tweak it out a little bit to tighten that up on your... Um, it has the zipper in here, a standard type shorts zipper. It's got nice padding around the back and transfer all that load into uh, your, your lower side to kind of support you in your lower back. It's got a leash connect tube back here. So if you want a slider leash on there, uh, this is removable. So if you don't care to have that back there, it does have leash connection pigtails on each side. So you can connect your leash there and they're built pretty good and long. I like that. I like a longer type short. Um, not the short, short ones. Obviously, we don't need chubbies in this sport, um, but we've got the, uh, the, the longer type short, heavy duty type nylon, uh, polyester nylon material, and it should last a long time. I like that construction buildup. On the inside, let me see if I can show it to you. It's got a neoprene um, strap, leg straps inside of here. So it's got the webbing uh, nylon in here, and then it has the neoprene to protect you from touching. And then all the adjustability for those straps are right here on the front, out, out here underneath your harness, um, uh, your harness bar connection points. But again, this is the right engine slash. It works with all of the right engine bars, works with a lot of the other bars out there in the industry. If it ha again, if it has a double strap, that's what you want to ch check and make sure it has these two connections in there. But a lightweight, great little harness. If you have any questions about it, this is a medium. I'm about a 32 waist. Uh, 30 to 32 and I'd definitely be on the medium size uh, on this range but if you have any questions about it what could work for you or what sizes don't hesitate give us a call here at kiteboarding.com and for the this is the new right engine slash seat shorts sheet seat harness I'll tell you it's fun you get a little tongue-tied anyway if you have any questions let us know